Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Daki. Thanks for being here. Thanks for coming and clicking on the video. I really do appreciate you guys. This farm is actually... I mean, we haven't gotten real far with this farm. There's so many things we can do with this, but... Uh, yeah, look, we're back in Minecraft. FTB Skies. Lovely place to be, and we're going to continue moving forward with this mod pack. However... Today, we're going to take a very, very slight tangent, and I think it will be a very cool uh, change. I think it will be a very cool uh, way to do what I'm thinking about doing. Also, I do need to fix all this and take all this away. Anyway, that's a different topic. Today, we're going to build this guy a treehouse. Yeah, I asked that question in the last uh, Minecraft video, and you guys said, yeah, look, let's build this guy a treehouse. He's been part of the world for, well quite some time he spawned in in the tree if you guys haven't noticed this or if you guys didn't notice go back and watch those old videos um he spawned in, in the tree and then somehow one of these fires here i think i even had a fire up here set this tree on fire and um yeah half burnt his tree down so today what we're going to do is we're going to build him a tree house and we're going to build him a nice decent tree house but to do so i'm not going to do it in cre uh, creative mode uh, sorry, survival mode. I am going to do it in creative mode. Yeah, this 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 mod does have the ability to, to switch into um, creative mode whenever you wish to, and I feel like this will be the best way to do this for this 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 nice villager that's been part of our world. I want to build him a de decent dope ass treehouse. I don't want it to be just a small thing. So the first thing I really 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 need to do is get him away from the tree uh, for the moment. There you go, buddy. I just want to bring him all the way out here somewhere. Yeah, this might be far enough. Give him a platform to be on. And that way he can just... Oh. Well, you could just fall out of the tree. Well, getting him back up in the tree is now going to be the issue uh, and the hard thing. But, uh, you know, we can work on that in a second. Anyway, now that he's down off of the tree... Hey! This is the first time on ground, buddy! Well done. Well done. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to come over this way, though? You want to hop back up in the tree? He... Wow. All right. Okay. There you go. Um, oh, you don't have a way up. There you go. Okay, this is interesting. I've not really interacted with... Yes. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Now that you're... Look, I don't understand him. Anyway, thank you for coming and watching this video. I really do appreciate it. We're going to build a nice tree house here. And um, yeah, if you do really like this video, feel free to give me a thumbs up. If there's something that I can do better, obviously give me a comment in the comment section. Let's begin, shall we? Sadly, I need you to be out of here, sir. I know you want to be up in the tree. Actually, let's get rid of all this. Will you follow this path? No, follow that path. Come on. Go on. You can do it. Don't fall off now. Don't fall off now. Here you go. Uh huh, uh huh. No, 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 no. Stop. You're not allowed back there. Not yet. I'm building you a treehouse, sir. You will love it, don't worry. Uh, and I'm going to put some walls up here so he doesn't fall off. Just bear with me, sir. It will be fine, don't worry. It's, it's okay. Alright, I need you to get in your box. Just, 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 there's a, go behind you. Behind you, sir. Sir. Thank you. A little bit more. Yep, we got this. Yep, you're fine. Yep. Back it up. Yep. Awesome. Alright, we have secured our villager. Alright, next thing. Let's build a treehouse. We need our base sorted. We're going to use the oak wood that it supplies us with. Um, I don't think there's a difference in the orientation. Uh, there is a difference in the orientation. Okay. All right, let's 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 secure ourselves a base here. First thing first, let's get rid of these. We don't need those. Um, chopping board can go. Ash can go. Um, yeah, let's get rid of some of these leaves. We'll use the leaves in a little bit. Okay, this is what I'm feeling. The base needs to be 
Also, I need to go, is it down? Versus across. Oh, it's across. Okay. Right, 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 right. So I need to go this way. Okay, I need to get all the wood grain lined up. Oh, that's challenging. Not impossible, challenging. Okay. I'm going to start just placing the wood down like this. This is going to give us our... Like our, our, our perception of the base of the tree. While we are doing this, I hope everyone is doing very fantastically. Very fan fantastic. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Oh, I don't know if I can get this. Oh, what about if I do this? Yes. Um, yeah, wherever you are in the world, wherever you stem from, I really do hope that you guys are having a great, great day, great time. Thank you for being part of the community. Thank you for being part of this journey that we are on. Um, I really do hope to get more videos out for you guys. I know I say this every video, but I honestly say this when I say I really want to get more videos out for you. Um, I really do enjoy, you know, making videos for you guys. I really do the enjoy the creative process. Um, like with everyone, we all get busy in life. We all, uh, we all have our challenges. We all have, you know, things we need to do. But, uh, yeah, I really do hope that I can, um, I can bring some more enjoyment to everyone's world by making these videos for you guys. So feel free, stick around for the journey. It, it could be good. It, it really could not, it could be, it could be interesting. Uh, hopefully it's not bad. Um... But yeah, that's my plan anyway. All right, let's get a little bit of a root system going on here. We kind of want it to look like that sort of thing. Maybe one there. Yeah, something like that. Okay, uh, we'll just make sure the wood grain is all orientated correctly. Okay, get rid of this ash. We don't need the ash anymore. All right. Get rid of all of this. This will be our base. Around here. Alright, let's keep going for this base and building it up. Concept that I'm going for is I want like a bit of a trunk to come up about the height of here. Then we have this nice house area that he can walk around. He's got a bit of a bit of a, a balcony he can go out on top of. Um, and then it continues up into the branches and, and the actual leaves and everything. I think you guys get what I'm going for here. So I'm just going to continue demolishing all of this. We don't need any of this at the moment. Basically redesigning the whole tree itself. I feel like as a base, that's pretty good. Now we need to go up. So let's just get a bit of a bit of a thing going on here. I want this to reduce in size because I don't want. Yeah, that's probably a good size if I'm honest. That's a that's a hefty tree root trunk thing here that we got going on. Now what I'm going to try and do is shift it a little bit. I need to shift it over. I'm just, just getting some ideas here. Yeah, that, that looks good. All right, we can shift it over. I don't want it that big though. What is it? Two by three. So we kind of want, we want that. And then we want, nope, we want this. Two by three. No, 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 no. I don't want it shifted that far. Yeah, actually, no, is that... Now, I know it's all different orientation. Don't worry. Yeah, actually. And, yeah, we, we'll go up from there. Okay, let's see if we can get all these orientated in the correct direction at the moment. Alright, we're going to demolish this tree here. And... We're done. Alright, buddy. Your tree is gone, ski. Now we need to build this up. We actually need to probably, you know what? Three by three is fine. I think also that height is, that's a fine height. We'll, we'll, we'll work on that. Okay. 
So now what we need to do is create a base, a platform. What I want to do is have a quick squiz at Oak. Oh, uh, wow. Man, I, I did, that was interesting. Oak, Oak, um, stripped Oak, da, 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 Oak slab, Oak stairs. Okay, you might be wondering, why are you doing this, Daki? I'm going to set up what's called as a pallet. Um, if you guys are uh, anyone in the artistry business, know what a pallet is. That's a pallet. Um, I, know, I know it sounds wrong. Here's, here's what it does. If I get rid of all this on my toolbar and I hover over one of these things and press the metal middle mouse button, I get it. If I want, just on time, Rain. If I want the oak log, I press the middle mouse button, I get it. Planks, strips. Yeah, that's called a pallet. It stays there. It gives me ideas on what I'm going to be using up here. Um, I also want darker wood as well. So if I just go wood, what's my, I've got oak wood. I've got spruce wood. Spruce is the darker one. We've been using spruce around the world. So maybe we get some spruce. So let's get some spruce wood, spruce logs, uh, planks, stripped, was it stripped? Stripped log. Okay. Strip log. I don't need strip wood. I need stripped logs, planks, and uh, birch wood. Where's it just birch? Is it that is just oh, that's special logs. Oh, birch wood. There we go. <clears throat> birch wood, log, planks, stripped, uh, planks, and stairs. So we'll add some contrast to our build over here. Uh, let's get rid of all that. That will suffice for the moment. Okay, let's let's have a think about what we're doing over here. We need a solid foundation, right? What would it look like, just as a curiosity, some stripped oak wood. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's go, just as a curiosity. The best thing about Minecraft is, doesn't work, redo it. I <laughs> love it. Yeah, you know what? That actually doesn't look too bad for a floor. Uh, versus, what we could also do is maybe the logs themselves. But it would look too similar to the tree trunk. Okay. I think we got our plan here. I think we'll use the stripped oak logs for the floor. Um, we will use maybe some plank variation which means we'll need a chisel, so plank variation for the walls. Uh, we will use, ooh, should we go darker or lighter for some trimming or accenting? I think we go dark for the roof and light for the accenting. Okay, that's a plan. Uh, let's get some spacing sorted out here. Now this will all be orientated correctly. Don't, don't stress, don't stress. It looks messy at the moment. Um, yeah, that looks good. We could bring him out one more this way. And we could bring him out maybe one more this way. I mean, we're making him a house. Like, we are making him a dope house. A really good house. Uh, a, a tree tree house. Yeah, I like that so far. That that spacing looks really good. Okay, cool. There's our floor. Now, it like, might look a bit eh, but from under here and over here. Oh, yeah, it still looks eh. Hmm. Okay. Do we orientate it a different direction? Do we orientate it that direction? Oh, I think we do. Golly. All right, well, uh, be right back while I quickly just get this sorted. And, um, yeah, we'll have a floor for him. <laughs> yeah, well, he's definitely going to get a big tree house. So what I've done is I've extended the base out one block in each direction. So he's got a little bit bigger of a platform. And I put these uh, slabs down. So these slabs are going to act as a bit of a, like a balcony he can walk out on. And... To be fair, I was considering getting these balconies just out a little bit more, so he's got a double space here. But you wouldn't really see the tree house. Anyway, we can fix up the balcony at a later stage. That's not the issue. I've just put some I've just put it down just to see how it goes. Alright, so how are we going to make the actual house itself? I just want something a little traditional, nothing out of the ordinary. And what I was thinking is we do the walls in uh spruce. Uh, not birch, spruce, birch maybe? 
Or do we fit the tr theme of the tree and go straight back to um, oak? You know what I might do is I might quickly just get rid of this wand. I really am scared about having wands in my inventory. Uh, just simply because I will hit something and it will just break. And I don't want that to happen. Um, if we have corners, say... This is going to be a big house. This is going to be a giant tree. Giant house. Um, these are going to be like the corners of the walls, right? I like that. I like that a lot. It's going to be a traditional, just uh, just a very traditional shaped tree house. It's nothing, nothing going to be, nothing special. It's just going to be, yeah, I kind of like that. Now, what do we do with... If we just do this, right? Yeah, I like this. I like this a lot. Okay, now that we need the wand back again. I... Oh, wa wand? Wand. We need a wand. I know that there's an undo button with the wand. I I, I definitely know, know that. But the wands really scare me. Um, they scare me because I if you accidentally hit the wrong button, they will... Um, they will inevitably just des not destroy. They will send you into chaos. And the rain stopped. Oh, and the sun is coming up. Beautiful. Lovely. Lovely. Alright, we are just going to do this and this. And get rid of that. This is going to be our framework. What do you guys reckon? Oh, yeah. That's pretty cool. Um, mm. do we have it higher? Or is this high enough? I think this is high enough for him. Um, yeah, I quite like this. All right, now we need some bru uh, spruce. We will go, oh no, spruce. I keep saying spruce. It's not spruce, it is birch. We're going to do some birch uh, for the walls. I want the planks and I want the re chisel mod because we can re chisel into something different. Now, what walls are we going to give this guy? We can give him. Uh, well, if we do this, right, if we do this, we can take away the uh, inner planks. We can give him walls that look like that. I reckon that just straight off the bat looks good. We can give him brick style walls, patented walls. No, none of these really look too good. Eh, I think we give it. We'll see, that looks pretty cool. I'm down for that. These all look... A little too much. So it's either going to be this one here or this one here. I'm going to say... Ooh, that's a hard choice between the two. I'm going to say this one here. Alright. Which we are calling it Small Birch Plank Bricks. Okay, let's just see what that looks like. Now we're going to create doors here in a second. Don't worry, don't worry. We'll create doors. We'll create areas for him to get in and out. We're not going to trap him in a prison. Yes. Dacky likey. Now, because I really do not want anything spawning in here when we are creating stuff, we are going to get a lantern, uh, but we want the feral flare lanterns, I think they are. There it is. We're going to whack one of those in the middle here. They're not going to set anything on fire, but it will stop uh, anything spawning in here while we're creating this treehouse. Okay. Um, how are we going to do this? Now, I want a door at the front here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. That is our center point. Should be a center point. One, two, three. One, two, three. Beautiful. Door goes there. Now, the door obviously won't fit exactly there, but that's sort of what it is. Uh, we want some windows. Uh, we actually want to open this area up at the back here. Beautiful. Let's do some more windows over here. Yeah, I think that initially is going to work. Beautiful. Okay. That is our starting point. The doors we'll get to, the windows we'll get to. Don't stress, we will get to all of those. Now for the roof. This is going to be, um, yeah, th this is where I want to use the the spruce. Definitely got that right. Spruce for the roofs. 
Now, I want just a, just a, uh, what are they called? It's not a, just a, just an apex roof. I think it's just an apex roof. We're going to be using the, um, the stairs and everything to help us here. But I feel like we're going to need a little bit more of the logs. So if we raise the roof up like so, is this going to be too high of a peak? No, I feel like that's okay. Yeah, I feel like that's fine. It will do. Is that um, too much wood though? It's all right. We'll find out in a second, won't we? Nah, I feel like that's okay. I feel like that's fine. All right. So what we want is we want some of the spruce stairs and we want to see if we can connect these stairs like saw. And we want stairs like this to make the pitch of the roof. Remember, we're not going too extravagant, but we're going extravagant enough. We're going to make this nice and nice and fancy for the guy. But yeah. Oh. Overhang for here will look something like will it look something like that. No, that looks a bit too. What about, oh, what about the spruce slabs? Here we go. Will this work? Yes. Yes, that looks good. Agreed. Everyone's on board with it. We're using the slabs. Okay. All right. That is pretty much exactly how I wanted that to look. Yes. Now, do we carry the slabs along here that's a design Ooh, that actually that actually splits the roof a little bit i like this i like this a lot what this might also allow us to do is change the wood feature there yeah 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 okay let me do a little bit more thinking but that is yep okay i'll be back with you in a second yeah you know what i think the spruce planks will look quite okay up there Let's, let's do that. Let's just put the spruce planks up. I think that they will be fine. It's a little bit of a transition from the wood. I think that looks, that looks really good. Actually, I was going to use the, um, the chisel mod here, maybe to change the spruce planks just a little bit, maybe to change it to look like the walls, which was, um, that there, I think it was actually, let's see what that looks like. Oh, that actually, that actually looks a little better. You know what? Yeah, it just gives it just a little bit of flavor. Done. All right, that is pretty much the base here. Ugh, I almost ran out the other end. Awesome. Now, what I wanted to do inside here was actually see if I can do the... Yeah. Nope, nope. I did it. Uh, my golly goodness. My golly goodness. I wanted to... Um, nope, I missed the step. Oh, there we go. I wanted to do this just to even out the roof a little bit. So it's not as harsh on the eyes yeah i like that versus that yeah definitely 100 percent, guys like it a lot all right we're going to need to get to the top of the to the top of the tree house here in a second and we're going to throw a whole bunch of design features in here um and we also got to put a bell like a railing so he doesn't <laughs> so he doesn't jump off the other thing as well is um let me just clear my inventory here is with the balcony here do we raise it or oh, not raise it put it out even one more yeah look putting it out one more is fine and it gives him a bit more room okay this is <laughs> he's got such a giant tree house <laughs> i love it to bits okay uh, we need doors, we need windows, we need to continue the roof. Um, uh, continue the tree. I'm going to continue the tree. This is going to take some time, so I might uh, edit out a lot of this. So, um, uh, yeah, this this will, this might take a this might take a little bit of time to uh, to finish. Let's just say that. So, if I stop talking for a while, uh, I do apologize. Okay, I can I can tidy up a few things there. That's fine. That's fine. Now we need branches and such. How are trees done? We've got a whole bunch of branches that come off of that. Um, we need to, we need to thin. It's too, it's too bulky. We need to thin guys. All right. We'll thin this way. 
get rid of you. Um, get rid of you, get rid of you. That's a bit better. That's a bit better. Okay, let's continue this up a little bit. Beautiful. Yeah, I think that's, I think that's gonna work. So these are all the branches that I've been um, playing around with. Now the branches obviously just give the tree a little bit of structure. So when we put the, um, when we put the leaves on, it's just going to give it a bit of structure and bulk. I don't want to go stupendously high, but I feel like that's going to do okay. So what I've also done is in the tree trunk here is hidden another feral flare lantern. Uh, this should, in theory, hope or hopefully stop anything spawning in the tree that we don't want to spawn in the tree. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much what we have going on so far. So before we go and throw all the branches on there, there's a couple of things I want to do. One is I want to tidy up this, how the tree goes through the roof here. Now, one of the ideas I've got going on is that we do something like this and we just integrate it, which I think is going to be my best option here. And then we can tidy it up a little bit with the, um, the chisel mod, the chisel and bits mod, which is... I'm sorry to say, going to actually take a little bit of time. It's not it's not a quick, easy thing to do, but I will go through and tidy it up with the chisel and bits mod because like this intersection right here doesn't look the greatest. So if we just throw a couple of bits of wood in there, now it looks a little bit more organic, uh, so to speak. Doesn't look as forced. Same with up under here, we can throw a little bit here. A little bit here and it, it really does tend to be random because in real life trees are well random i mean you don't have a tree that's perfect well maybe there is a tree that's perfect but a little bit of randomness goes a little bit of a ways so we're just going to throw a bit of randomness in there and i can also see a little bit of a spot right here that could go with a little bit of randomness yeah, look, I'm happy with that. It looks a little bit messy, but that's what trees are. If you go and see a tree out in real life, that it just, just looks random. All right, we're going to throw a whole bunch of leaves, and we're going to extend the branches out a little bit here. Um, yeah, I'll show you what that looks like as well. Uh, now we want oak leaves. Um, yeah, oak leaves are fine. We're actually going to place it down onto our pallet down here as well. So it's going to look very similar. Just It's going to look a little bit messy. But this is, this is what it's all about. Let's throw some leaves out this way. I don't know how uh, far I can go. Can I just go indefinitely with leaves? Oh yeah, pretty much. Okay. Good. All right, I'm going to throw all these leaves up along here. You guys don't need to see this part. This part's going to take a little bit of finesse. It will take a little bit of time, so I'm just going to quickly just whack leaves everywhere. And then we're going to get into some interior design work. I'll see us in a little bit. You know what? I actually... That looks pretty cool. I wanted to give it a massive canopy. Um, and I'm still building on it. I think I'll still continue to build on this and make the canopy just look a little bit more... Uh, thicker, a little bit more grandiose. Um, all I've been doing is just placing leaves in like random spots like this, um, just giving it some thickness and some, um, making it look like the canopy itself is really uh, something of the tree. Like this is a this is a serious tree, and it's just been carved out to be a, a tree house. I this is kind of what I've envisioned for sure. But we're going to move on to the interior design work. We're going to give him. We're going to give him an interior. So the first thing I need to do is put up a feral flare lantern. Actually, I might put two up. Uh, you know, it's not even. So, you know what? Let's make it look a little bit even. There we go. We can get rid of that one, which is good. Beautiful. Okay, let's clear our inventory. We don't need any of this at the moment. We will keep the chisel, though. Okay, so it's not going to be a, um, a giant interior, but it's going to be enough. First thing we need to do is put down a bed. Now, what bed should we put down for him? Uh, uh, red bed, green bed. Ooh, illusion beds. I didn't know there was illusion beds. I don't think there's anything. Oh, an acacia fancy bed. An oak fancy bed. You know what? Should we just do a spruce? A, sp Bruce, a spruce fancy. Can we lay in this? <gasps> we can lay, lay in this. Oh, he is definitely getting a fancy bed, but you know what? Also got the uh, achievement, nice. Um, you know what we are going to do? 
we're gonna give him dark oak fancy bed yes but not one we're gonna give him a double bed hell yeah we're giving him a double bed all right we need some bedside tables is there tables uh oh goodness uh there is some sprues let's go dark oak side tables mm-hmm mm -hmm. yes now what can go on the side oh they're a little bit high up they're a little bit high up uh that's okay i don't think that matters too much if i'm honest uh no that's fine a tinkering table oh okay mason table loom table carpenter's table uh what does this look like oh oh that's cool can i interact with it oh it's actually a thing okay well um yeah we'll work that out um lanterns on the roof which are fine we don't need lanterns down here um door oh we need a door now what i was thinking of is a fancy fancy door here should we give him Ooh, some birch screen doors pressed doors okay all right sliding a sliding birch door what is what is a sliding hang on let me get let me get this out of the road okay that's just a that works i like that um what other doors do we have here we have i think Oh, there's even more bamboo doors. There's so many doors in this mod pack. Yep, that's the one we go for. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We're gonna just put some more of that up there. That completes the front. Now we need some glass. We're gonna use either clear glass or glass panes. Or what else can we use? Okay, let's have a look. Lead paned glass. Actually, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, 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 I like that. Well, wait a minute. Why did you do that? No. Why? Why are you not playing ball like over here? Why? What is what is the difference? Oh, okay. I just got to do it from this side. Anyway, that's cool. Glasses. No. Why does it look different from the inside? What is going on? Oh no. Does it mean it looks different from the outside? No. Okay, that's not gonna work. Get rid of get rid of that. Let's just go glass pane. Yeah, glass panes are gonna do. <laughs> Why did that look different from the inside to the outside? I don't I don't know. I'm not gonna question it. Alright, let me show you what I've got going on so far. You can see some additions to the uh, to the house at the moment. I'll uh, hide the interior for the moment. <laughs> um, I'll show you some additions to what we've just done. I've been playing around with a little bit of ideas and whatnot, but the next stage of what we've got going on is going to take quite a long time. So... Um, I could stop the recording here. I could, you know, um, go and do what I need to do and then come back to this this recording. So uh, let me show you what I've got going on inside first and then um, we'll uh, I'll do what I need to do and then we'll wrap this video up. But basically, I've extended the roof just a little bit to give him a bit of shelter uh, from rain and such. Now, there's uh, I'm still working on a bit of the design aspect, but I, just, I don't know how to reveal this, but there we go. There's the... <laughs> <laughs> let's just let's go in and see so we got the front doors here which are pivot doors now i'm not sure if we're going to need pressure plates for this dude i don't know if he should be able to just open these doors but we've got a orange infused fabric carpet and the moment we walk in the doors then as we spin around we've got the double bed with some spruce side tables and yes some of the dynamic lighting i've added a couple of the birch planks above it just to give it some bulkhead this is oh speaking of bulkhead should we do something like that? That's called a bulkhead. Um, basically, yeah, look, we'll play around with that, obviously. Um, whether we do uh, something, uh, you know, we'll, we'll muck around with that in any case. But the lighting gives it just a little bit of a feel, which I really, really do like. Um, moving up to the ceiling, we've gotten rid of the feral fair lanterns and we put the lighting up there as well. This lighting does illuminate, which means we'll not get things spawning up here. And we've added him a kitchen, including of a fridge, some cooktops, uh, a sink, and a bit of light just to give him some some light, and obviously some storage above. Um, 
yeah, so he's got a kitchen. But then on the back deck, we've also extended the roof here and we've given him some extra, uh, some lighting as well. And obviously a table with some chairs where he can sit down as well. Yes, buddy, we're making it real. And obviously we've extended the, 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 the roof just a little bit there. I'm still working on the design. And on the front here, I've just experimented with, I'm waiting for it to go nighttime, but I've experimented with a bit of lighting up under the, like, uh, at eve. So I'm going to see if that illuminates a little bit there as well. But I'm going to spend the next little bit with the chisel and bits mod, which is what I've got in my hand here now. I'm going to smooth out some of the edges underneath here. I'm going to add some handrails with the chisel and bits mod as well, so he doesn't just jump off the edge. And yeah, I will be back with you when this is done. Now, again, this might take a little bit of time, so there might be a bit of a, uh, a voice change when I go from this to, say, a couple of hours ahead of time. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you when I've got all this sorted. But this is turning out to be a lot larger than I expected it to be, but still definitely something I'm, I'm very pleased with. All right, guys, I'm going to continue doing this, and I'll see you in a little. You know what? I would, I would live up here. This is, this is pretty good. This is pretty, pretty dandy, really. So, which, we're actually ready to move this guy into his new home. Where is he? There he is. Hi, little fella. We are ready to move him in. Now, we've done a little bit of adjustments, and I've still got a long way to go. But to complete this video, what I've done is... I've made him a handrail all the way around his nice little treehouse here. We've tidied up the roof area here and there is some lights in there. Hopefully they can emit a little bit of light up there. There's also lights in the underside here, which will emit, which is really good. What we've done is created a balustrade around the outside of his veranda. Now, the other thing as well is it's very hard to see, but I've had, um, I forget what the name of these things are right here that I'm looking at, where the railing comes down to where it attaches to, say, the, the veranda itself. It's like a finial or something. Anyway... I've added a little bit of a design aspect there, but it's hard to see because it's oak on oak. Um, there is a couple of things I wish to do, but I might do this uh, away from the video, is I would like to add some, um, I would say, girders or brackets that attach from this tree up to the actual platform itself. Now, I will end up probably doing that off of camera, but for the moment, what we have to do now is get this fella up to... Um, up to the up to up to his new home so i'm going to create a bit of a staircase here somewhat that he can um or that we can push him up to <laughs> to his base i guess uh this might take a little bit of time but um yeah we're just going to simply uh, we're underneath it now aren't we if we can just direct him this way and <laughs> he's got a bit of a staircase to climb um but that's fine that's fine. He'll uh, he'll get there. Uh, we're just gonna now move this direction, and actually, that's that's pretty much leveled where I want him to be, right? So if we just get him to come this way just a little bit more, oh, I can't put blocks there because of yeah. Okay, all right. This is gonna be an issue. We're gonna have to drop him into the base um, because these are classified as a block. Uh, that's okay. Um, can't place it there either. Okay, he's gonna have to, he's gonna have to free fall into the base. I'm so sorry, my dude. Um, okay, let's put some stairs so he can climb. And we will put some walls around this because, look, I don't want him falling. Uh, I don't want him falling off of here. That would be terrible. It's gonna look messy, but it's gonna make some sense. Oh, nope, that's not what I wanted. Uh, let's just put some walls. Actually, I didn't need those two, do I? I just need this, uh, like that, so he can't fall, oh, actually he can still fall off of there, can't he? Stop it. Stop falling off my base. Okay, we'll put some walls here. I really don't want him falling off. I really do not, this is so intricate, just to get him up onto our base, or his base. But you are not going to fall off. Not on me, sir. I will I will protect you while you carry you know, climb these stairs. It's this is this is more in depth than it needs to be, but I am I'm I'm if he falls to his death, all this would be for nothing, right? And we'll have to just find a new villager and oh it's it would be such a pain. Anyway. That said, we are almost there. 
almost there and look ladies and gentlemen if you guys have enjoyed these videos if you've enjoyed this video in particular feel free to um you know again leave me a comment let me know how i'm going uh give me a thumbs up and um most importantly if i've really really impressed you then feel <laughs> look at this staircase actually maybe i should just attach a staircase down to the and no nope, no nope, we've already done we've already gone this far remember to subscribe if i've ex exceeded your expectations oh i can't put uh oh no i can't put things down there yeah if i've exceeded your expectations feel free to subscribe to the channel you know you you guys are smart you guys know what to do um thank you i really do appreciate it you know what he shouldn't fall through there he he shouldn't oh no if he does oh dear okay all right are we are we ready for him to ascend to his new heights in his tower i think we're ready my dude let's go sir come on man up the staircase we come on buddy we got fish would you like some fish okay you'd like some fish okay up you come come on don't go that way yeah i know you want to jump that way come come this way though buddy buddy up here up here there you go yes yes now over here come on man you are almost there no 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 come here sir sir away from the edge <laughs> come this yeah we've done it he's in his base yes 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 <coughs> oh god i'm choking we have made it he is in his tree house <laughs> look at him oh my god it's so cute look at him yeah yeah we've created a tree house. okay i gotta get rid of these stairs uh let me just quickly demolish these how cool was that? That is, um, yeah, I, I, I enjoyed that. that <laughs> Are you in there? Can you open the doors? Do I need to put a, can you, oh, he might not know how to open those doors. Um, ah, that's okay. We'll, we'll figure that out. Let me get rid of all these stairs and everything here. We don't need any of this. Is this all attached to anything? It's not attached to anything. Bonk and bonk and bonk and bonk and bonk and bonk we don't need any of that all right that's all clear guess what he's in his base he is he is in there uh let's have a look hello <laughs> oh water hey yeah we've done it i don't think you can open those doors Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be the video. We have created a treehouse. And there's still more to go. I'm still going to add some additions to this treehouse as well. We're going to call the video here. Thank you so very much for coming and watching the video. I really do appreciate it. I appreciate you guys being here. And I will see you guys on the next video. Goodbye, everybody.